we're going to get to the reason of the video. Uh, but I'm going to ask that you really quick, I'm going to put the link down below to his channel. Go in over there and subscribe. Okay, well, let's bump him up over that 10,000. All right, guys, KB32 here. Check it out. So we're sitting over here in the uh, Freedom office. Uh, been three weeks, I guess, since I've actually done a video. Three weeks tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> reason being, uh, my real job, we were tasked with, let's just say this, accomplishing a ton of things in a short period of time and uh, required most of my team and myself to work 16 hour days or at least up to 16 hour days for three weeks straight. I'm not bitching because, hey man, some people just don't even have a job. So that's it. Uh, <laughs> we're all blessed. So back to doing videos. Uh, there's a reason for this video and it's a really cool one because uh, not often do you have Someone reach out to you from the past, and uh, this guy was one of them, the range. Hey, man. <laughs> uh, so he sent me an email talking about one of the guys who is up there in uh, Illinois. And, you know, we're all talking about the BS in there. There's some uh, lawsuits that happened. Some people got uh, taken. They took care of some things and, you know, could be taken away in a moment's notice because some people are just that way. So I wanted to read this email the range wrote to me. What a great guy. OK, and we go way back because I worked uh, at the Dirksen building, if you know what that's at, in Chicago for three years. And uh, there's some uh, really cool hackneys and a couple other things, Howard's Chicken, that stuff. So it's been a really long time since we last exchanged emails. I was an early sub of yours way back in the day. Yes, I do remember this. I do read emails, guys. I do. Um, there are some out there that, you know, they make crazy requests and there's some people just want to say hi, which is really cool. You and I talked a bit about when you used to work in the shy town, <laughs> of course, that conversation led to food and you're telling me how much you like hackneys for the great burgers. Absolutely. I've been very inactive on YouTube as well as we all, most of us have as great vids of old days are long gone. Yeah. Uh, and again, one of these things I'm going to do throwback Thursday where these videos that I had to take off, I'm taking them down and I'm going to re-edit them. I'm going to I'm do a thing, reason why I want to put them back up because they are of importance. To me, they are. I'm writing to say hello for, first and foremost. I'm also going to ask for a huge favor since you have such a wide reach on your view channel now. I'm 100% sure you've seen all the nonsense we're going through in Illinois and the assault weapons ban and the mag bans. It's much worse than that, though, actually. Actually, far worse <laughs> than most people think. And, guys, the reason I'm doing this video is I need a feel-good video. I'm sure you guys need a feel-good video. I don't want to try to sell anything in this thing. I'm almost sick and tired of it. Um, you probably don't remember, but I'm a longtime member of the Aurora Sportsman's Club out in Waterman, Illinois. It's the largest and, in my opinion, the best range in the six-state area where 600-plus acres and since we elected a new president, the club has improved exponentially. It's a world-class facility with ranges for every kind of discipline in shooting sports. That's pretty cool. Guys, if you're familiar with this place, tell me what your thoughts are down below. We're also very blessed to have on our board of directors a guy named Todd Vandermeid. Vandermeid. Mide. Okay. Did you guys tell me that? Mide. He was the NRA contract lobbyist right up to and through the Springfield Armory and Rock River Arms scumbaggery. Absolutely. And guys, that's one of the reasons why, man, I went and bought a XDM 525. And then I have a, a, a bunch of Springfield stuff. And then that shit happened. So I, I didn't even want to do a video on it. Another reason is a lot of people send me products and they're made in China. Well, right now is not a good time to be doing product reviews on items made in China. So, yeah. Okay. He was none too pleased with that move that the NRA ended up shit canning him. Uh, I hope you don't mind me reading this email. Okay. So they did so late on Friday afternoon via email. Of course, a bunch of cowards. That's how they do things. That was a number of years ago, but still bothers me. Todd's a smart dude and a fighter for our Second Amendment rights. This is something that I really care about. We're going to get to the reason of the video, uh, but I'm going to ask that you really quick, I'm going to put the link down below to his channel. Go in over there and subscribe. Okay, well, let's bump him up over that 10,000 mark. Okay, so let's keep reading. Uh, he's the best in the biz, in my opinion, and calls a spade a spade. That's why he's no longer with the NRA. Yeah. He has a great YouTube channel that focuses on Illinois 2A law and national 2A law, and of course, Aurora Sportsman Club. He's not... Uh, one of those guys that has a channel and doesn't know how to shoot. He's a real shooter. I was wondering if you'd be willing to give his channel, Freedom Steel, Freedom Steel, a nice shout out. Well, of course I will, man. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's get him up past 10,000 sub count. Okay, just because we need all the help we can get. And, man, you know what? That's the cool part about what we do. 
If I have a moment to help somebody, I will. And this is like one of those feel-good moments here because this is a guy who uh, who wants to share with you his thoughts and ideas and things of that nature. Uh, that's it. I hope all is well with you and the family, friend. I do miss the awesome KB shooting videos. You and me both, bud. We can still do videos and shooting. It's just uh, I got to find the time. Uh, but totally understand with it's no longer worth putting the YouTube in such a crap platform. Yeah. So anyway, guys, that's it, man. A feel-good video. Um, let's see here. Freedom's Steel. The link's down below. That's it. We're going to be going back at it. We might do a couple videos and doing reviews and things of that nature. Uh, just got to find the time and the need and the inspiration and the strength to do it. Because I, honestly, yeah, my mind's crap. All right. With that being said, guys, I was in them like this. God bless America. God bless us men, women in uniform 24-7 for our freedom because freedom is not free. You guys be good. I'm KB32 and I'm out of here. Boom. Yeah, man. It's been a while.